The Lord is my light and my salvation. Who shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Good morning, good afternoon. Good evening, everyone. I am led to testify what God has done for my family and I. We have been passing through challenges since I was born. There is nothing that I do that works for me. No matter how I try, no matter how I push, no matter how I work, things never works well for me. There is a lot of stagnancy, disappointment, failure, hardship, pains, sorrow. I'm not the only one passing through this situation, but my siblings. The more we pray, the more we seek God, the more we wait patiently, the more we try to look for solution, the more it becomes worse. I have tried. I don't know what else to do. I have been in pain for seven years. Despite what the doctor said, I said, no, I will never do what they say. Because I know I was not born with it. It must surely go the way it comes. I begin to bear the pain no matter how it is. No matter how it is, I said I will bear the pain. I still pray to God. I still wait upon the Lord because I know that one day, he will do it for me. But thank God for his goodness and mercy upon my life. On one faithful day, on the live broadcast with the woman of God on Tuesday, the Spirit of the God, the Spirit of the Lord located me. The woman of God speak to me. He did deliverance for me. And God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit deliver my family and I today. He delivers us from stagnancy, struggle, failure, setback, disappointment, hatred, sickness. I mean, He set us free. Even though when the devil tried to take me away from the ministry, the devil tried to steal my testimony. The devil tried to take away my joy by putting the spirit of kindness on me and I, I left the gathering of the children of God. But because of God is so merciful, his love upon my life, he brings me back because he knows that this is where my deliverance will be. So that day, God really works on me and my family. He set my family free. He has liberated us from whatever that we have been passing through. He has wiped our tears away. He has taken away my pains, my sorrow, my tears. He has returned my joy, good health. He has returned everything that the devil has stolen from me. He has given me peace. So I am here to return all the glory to God the Father, to God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. My brothers and sisters, I want you to know that that the same God of yesterday, today, and future, that the same God is still speaking, that the same God is still hearing prayers, that the same God is still healing, that the same God is still delivering. He never failed, He never changed. If my destiny is owned by devil, if I am created by the devil, 
I wouldn't have been delivered today. My destiny wouldn't have been set free. My siblings wouldn't have set free. But because I am created by the God Almighty, because my destiny comes from Him, that is the reason why I am set free today. So I have come to testify. I have come to give God the glory. I have come to say, God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I thank you and I bless your holy name. And also thank God for his grace. I celebrate the grace upon the woman of God. I celebrate the anointing upon her life. And I pray that the God Almighty will protect, we guide her, we be with her and the ministry. That no weapon fashion against her and the ministry will never prosper. Father, may your name be lifted up. May your name be glorified. Amen. Thanks and God bless.